Next we'll do the PZ2C. Left hand side while he's moving. Since so you're gonna aim one hit right between the last two rollers. And you get the nice one. This will give you an idea of where I was aiming. room for leeway on these than there is with the ATR. Same deal with the 38T. Lower right corner and he'll pop it. That's a pretty hard shot to hit since you can't really aim down the rifle. Here again, you want to aim PC4D on the left hand side. Aimed right in the middle. Didn't Remember do any three hitting legs. That'll explode it. There you go. Show you this so you can see how just a little bit of a change can make the difference. Easy 4D, essentially where you would ATR a 4G. Get the engine kill. So if you're gonna waste three grenades on it, you might as well just go to the sides and DP? kill it with one. The die. Got a die. Roger that. So we'll just come around to the side now and finish her off. That did it. Just a little bit lower than exact middle on the side. <laughs> Here with the PZ4G, aim towards the bottom in the middle. Get the nice flames. Went towards the middle and the bottom. And you get all the nice flames. Aim a little bit further towards the rear. And you still get the nice flame. Aim a little bit more towards the front. And you get the explosion. like seeing four G's burn. Here's some four G on the move action. It's the left hand side. I judge the direction it's moving. Target and fire. Forging moving away. And essentially where you would try and ATR it. Aim right underneath the top track. Nothing. Go a little bit lower. And you can get the nice explosion. There again. Shows you how, how exact the shot needs to be. Aim 
lower. In the middle of the two final tracks. And you get the nice explosion. Here again. PC4G. Nice moving target kill. Here, just like the SAPs, just work on all the PZ3 series. Of course, you need to have a grenade loaded. That only works on the right hand side toward the rear. Here again, same spot where you zap it. Again, just to show you how exact this one is. A little bit low right there isn't good enough. You got to take it a little bit further behind and a little bit higher or lower. All right, that got me. Left hand side on three G's tricky shot. I. More or less opt for the uh, rear right shot if you can choose. Here again, 3G on the move. Finally, we're going to show you how to track a tiger and kill it with a rifle. Gun. Fire at the front sprocket wheel and you'll track it. Now, if he's got his uh, commander up, that's pretty much the only way you'll be able to get the kill. So, you can either be patient, hope he doesn't despawn. If he pops his turret, if he pops his commander up, take him out quick. And then you want to reload the grenade, climb up on top of the tiger. Just crawl around. Once you get on top, you can stand up, walk towards the front of the turret, go around to the back of the commander. You want to be standing on the commander hatch and fire. Sometimes they'll explode it, sometimes it won't. Sometimes you kill yourself, sometimes you won't. Uh, but you should get the kill.